Well, hello, my boys and girls. Welcome, welcome, welcome to another edition of What's Going On Around the Grid. Brought to you by Moi. Yes, guys. Well, today is another edition that's taking me to this interesting event. It's called my bloody valentine is presented by solstice events guys solstice events and it just started today boys and girls and i figured let me go ahead i have some time in my hands and cover it and bring it to you all you lovely beautiful people out there so from from my understanding i it's this event started today and um, I think, if I'm not mistaken, it's going to be making its course until Valentine's. Well, I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. I'm not quite sure. But I know it started today. So why not? Let's go ahead and check it out and see what's going on over here. So without further ado, let's start off and pick up a, an attack point. And there we are. We're going to start over here. Now, I love this theme of my bloody valentine because it's quite interesting though and this is from after party now i do love after party after party i like you guys you guys are pretty cool and stuff and as always they got some pretty neat things over here so if you guys are interested in any of after party's products go ahead and check it out they are wonderful i have my, my house is basically decorated with a lot of their neon stuff so yeah and uh this little theme number going on over here. Daddy's chain. Mm-hmm. I kind of like that little chain effect going on there. Plus, those pants are like, yeah. I like. <laughs> okay. What do we have over here? Now, this is called Bespoke. Right? And uh, what's going on over here? Now, this looks kind of interesting. It looks like it's skin. Balm Slow S L U V Full Body Masculine Skin. Ah, okay. So this is Balm Ready. Now, if you guys want to achieve this look, okay, it's Monster Stein Fantasy Mesh Head. Mesh Head. Now, if you guys want to run around looking around the grid having this kind of look, hey, whatever floats your boat. You know what I'm saying? Go for it. Have fun. Knock yourself out. This is totally not me, but it is great for role play, fantasy role play. And so forth. So, yes. Now, alongside over here, follow up with this release. Oh, this is kind of interesting. I do kind of like this, though. That's kind of weirded out. But, hey. Whatever floats your boat, work it. Oh, in fact, look. There's a, there's a little demo copy right there. Come on, let's take a quick look at that. Uh, oh, snap. Uh, uh, okay. Hey, it's a look. Right? God, it kind of remind me of somebody I know in real life. Just saying. But yes, minus the stitches and the bloody cuts. But that big face. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let's press forward, guys. Now, I've noticed I got some little booths over here. So let's go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and pan into this from this section over here instead of going from booth to booth. Now, what I see here is from Eos. Now, this is interesting. Snapper plant bento. Oh, okay. Well, that's a cute little bento effect going on. You got your nails, the love claws, and the wings. This is great. Great for uh, fantasy role play, especially the, now that um, Fantasy Fair should be coming around the corner. Now, that's pretty cool if you guys are into this sort of style. Then, Simply Shelby's got this cute little valentine set thing going on over here if you guys are interested i mean i love decorating so i love st furniture like this you got the little you want to send your lover a, uh, a message saying oh oh shit whoa, whoa, wait a minute now that wasn't cool that was not cool hold up i that was not cool that i just actually tp myself out to the other section there hold on <laughs> just bear along with me <laughs> Guys, my mouse has been acting up crazy, so let's go ahead and continue on this again, okay? Now, like I said, I would say, if you guys want to send a message, there you go. I clicked two times and it sent me to the front there, so that was my fault. Now, 
But what do we got over here? Now, this is kind of interesting. If you girls are interested in this look. Very Lolita goth. I'm digging it. It comes in a fat pack and a variety of co individual colors. Then you got the little doily choker thing going on over here too as well. And the crown. You cannot forget the crown. Which creates that effect right there. Now that is kind of cute though. It's kind of like a little rose in the middle there. So... I do like it. It's got individual colors and it's a cute accessory. So, like I said, you know, don't forget to accessorize. Now, what's this over here? This is a pose, I would imagine. Give you my heart. Now, I would think twice on that there because I wouldn't give my heart to no one else. Yes, I am not even going to touch that subject, but it is a great picture pose, if you guys want to go ahead and set a statement on that. Now, you got Ginkgo. Some cute little hair over here. Now, this is kind of cute, though. I can dig this. If you girls are into it, I love that kind of style from Ginkgo. And, uh, yeah, it actually comes in a variety of colors also from what I see here, so... Yeah, you got the red, you got the browns, you got the black and whites, the blondes, and the colorful. So, there you go. It's Ginkgo. And what do we got here? Ah, oh, more Lolita Goth outfits. Now, we got ears. Paranoid love earrings. Oh, not ears. What I'm saying. You got earrings. Ooh, now this is kind of cute, though. I, I do dig this. I love earrings like that. You guys can tell I got something similar to that. That dope and mercy was very kind enough to bestow upon me. Thank you very much, my love. Then we got the Kangish Jiwan. Okay, let me say this right before I get some slack on this. It's called Jiangishi Girl. There you go. That is a statement all to itself. The traditional Chinese hat. That comes along with that too. So you got the hat, the earrings. What else do they got over here? A halo. That sets a statement all to itself right there. If it's broke, leave it alone. That sets a statement. That's style. That's fashion. There we go. <laughs> then we've got this little outfit over here. And it is from Una. As always, Una, I love Una's clothes. Una, Una makes some really nice, interesting outfits over here. Good job, Una. Then we got this little nun-looking outfit over here. It's very Amish. I am digging this look. Okay, if you guys are into that, that's, that's hey, to each his own, right? And we got Miércoles. Now, Miércoles means Wednesday in Spanish, guys. Wednesday, Miércoles. Blouse and white blouse per color. Oh, and you do get a variety of colors also as well over here. So if you guys are interested in that style, there you go from Una, right? Una, there you go. All right. Then we've got this little look over here. Okay. If you guys are into fantasy role play, these are the perfect outfits for those, for that theme there. Or everyday wear, you know? You're into Amish, you want to churn some butter, milk the cows, run through a field of daisies, that's all on you, girl. All right. And next door, we got Short Leash. As you guys know, Short Leash with their, uh, their little, you know what, I'm not even going to touch that subject, but you guys know what, exactly what I'm driving at, Short Leash. There you go. Lilith Elixirs. Mm-hmm. Now, Garbaggio. I love Garbaggio. Now, this is kind of... i Not kind of. I like this. This is cute. I love this. Okay. My bloody Valentine glam dolls. I mean, look how cute. You can't go wrong. You can buy the boy or the girl. You got the full set. Okay. It's got a little... Uh, Beetlejuice theme going on over here. Now, now this is kind of cool. Now, you see, I like this little steampunk style outfits. 
Now, this is cool. It's art by made by art and co evil hunters set as you guys can tell here this is for both boys and girls if you guys are interested in this kind of style hey nothing wrong now the boots look do look good though even if you just buy the pants and the boots and you can style it off with a different blouse hey whatever works nothing wrong with this good job guys you actually are aiming at my round because i like wearing stuff like that now, what do we got here? Bloody Lovers. Now, this is a necklace. Seems as if it has some bloody pearls. Oh, some bloody pearls. But hey, it sets a statement. Beautiful picture. Do like that. Alongside, you also get some other... Uh, what's this? Shibari Teacher. Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of interesting. Okay, cute little outfits over here. If you girls are into this kawaii style fashion, okay, let's keep on rolling over here, guys. I'm gonna do it this way. And what is this? This looks like it's a bloody toilet. I do not feel like using the toilet now, but yes, there you go. <laughs> From Craftwork, I have a lot of their items. Craftwork, you guys really design really nice. So if you guys are interested in this, style furniture hey there's nothing wrong with that i do kind of like this though you got both pg and adult then we got here from elm obviously elm i love elm and this is amazing i love it i noticed on the cake topper there let's see you got both girl and girl. Then you got the guy and guy. Then you got the regular straight couple. Hey, love is love, guys. Till death do us part. Right. Till death, but you're the one that's going first, honey, not me. Just saying. <laughs> now you got some cute accessories over here. Now, this looks like your traditional Irish... Um, Clattering. Now you guys know exactly what I'm talking about because I do have one myself. Yes. Very nice, very ornate. And you got the thorn earrings, accessorized as always. Nomad. We've got the altar table top over here from Nomad. If you guys are into this, listen by all means, have fun with your second life and don't let nobody prove you wrong. Now we have a duvet duvet day okay that comes both in pg and adult if you guys are into goth style furniture nothing wrong with that because i am into it also tarred fish ugla what uga heart eyes okay that's uga heart eyes oh there it is right there in front of me let's take a look she's gonna pop it she's gonna start popping off right there there you go she just popped off her eyes. Mm -hmm. Now that is kind of cute though. I do like that. That's from Tarfish. I like Tarfish. They're right. And what do we got here? The Bloodbound set. It's Bloodbound. It is a couple set here. You can buy individual pieces or you can buy the full set. Wow, now I see why they call it my bloody Valentine's. This is very morbid, but it's very sexy and hot at the same time. Just saying. <laughs> then you got your balloons. As I love collecting my balloons. Hey, now this is a cute additional piece to my pack. It's from Dahlia. My good friend Dahlia. Love you, girl. You, oh God, girl. I, I live in your store. Dahlia, as always, once again. Now, Elia also made this over here. Wow, what's this, girl? So this is Marlena Dress. Okay, well, if you guys are into that stuff, that's all. Okay. And accessories over here. The choker, the earrings, and another key set earrings over here. It's the key heart earrings. And then you got that there. All right. Let's go. What's going on over here? Cubic cherry. I love my cubic cherry. Yes, Cubic, how's it going, love? This glasses are called Amor. 
Hmm. I like it because it looks like it's hand drawn, but it's wearable. It's like 3D print like. It's kind of cute though. I am digging that. But look at it right there. I'm going to bring it a little close up to it so you guys can see the actual product. Now, that is cool though. It got a cool little effect. If you guys love accessorizing with uh accessories and stuff god i just farted out for a second whoops <laughs> and what do we have here from apple blossom now this is interesting it is an interesting outfit but it's very nice at the same time now you do get a multiple array of colors over here from blacks to whites to yellows to blues also comes in a fat pack as well you got your I call the male shoes over here. This is from actually Libra. Interesting pair. Now they do have them for both guys and for girls and for kids. So if you guys are into this style, okay, this looks like clown shoes. I just noticed that. I I, I thought they were regular combat boots, but they're actually clown shoes. Hey, if you're into that, go for it. All right. Let oops. Before I end up, what's this? That looks like it's an outhouse. Okay, that's a mess. Somebody was planning a murder there. Okay, let's keep going. Now, this is from Little Fox. Interesting. I do like the striped pants. Now, some don't, some do. But if you hook it up, depending how you hook it up, it's doable. But if this is your forte, I don't know what to Little Fox. They got a couple stuff over here. Now, this is interesting. I will not let you go into the unknown alone. And now, I will let you go into the unknown alone if I see a scenery like this, which really I am not into, but I see something like this. I guarantee you, you will be going by yourself. Just saying. <laughs> and I'm sure you guys will agree on that. Now, what do we got here? Now, we got some, a cute little accessory over here, lollipop effect. Now, that would be actually from Halo. It's from Halo. Oh, it looks like there's some kind of accessory in here. Aha! Uh -huh. There you go. The best way to get rid of somebody, hey, have a, give them a little sucker and... Wow, let me not even think about it. But yes, you know what I'm talking about. Now, what we got over here, the Fallen Gods. Fallen Gods, I like your skins. You guys make some really, really amazing skin. Great for picture taking as well. You got your whole different effects going on here. Uh, yes, I am digging that. So, wow, this is kind of cool looking now. All right, and it comes for by, for both guys and for girls. If you are interested in this style, great for role play, or you just want to live your life as a vampire. Nothing wrong with that. Moss and Mink. I love Moss and Mink, guys. You know what I'm talking about. Moss and Mink, you guys make some really beautiful stuff. And they sell some individual pieces over here that looks like it's a little candelabra, table, pictures, accessories. And what this says here, exclusive. Oh, wait a minute, let's read this. Place a landmark in the contents to send user the location of your choice or leave it as a teleport, as is to teleport your victim to a random location, same, same, same only. Ah, oh, okay. So that's a teleporter. Now that is a cool effect. Plus you got your little candelabra there, which is really nice. Now, Vlad and Amina, you've got bento poses over here. Great for picture taking. If you guys are interested, you got the individuals and you also have the fat pack. So it is by gravity. Now, you got here from Bubble. Bublo. Bublo. Bublo? Bublo, yes, Bublo. And let's see, you got some accessories over here, guys, if you guys are interested in. Hey, well, Accessorizing is absolutely, absolutely nothing wrong with that, guys. So, I mean, I love accessorizing too. You know, you hook up an outfit, throw a little, you know, a blanket, a blanket, really, throw yourself a blanket, throw yourself a bracelet, a necklace, you know, just accessorize, guys. <laughs> just accessorize. A blanket can't be used as an accessory, too. Just saying. <laughs> Absinthe. 
Absinthe. Okay, what's going on with Absinthe over here? And it appears to be Valentine chess carvings. It's bone, it's tattoos, guys. Then you got the Valentine eyes, and you got here the Valentine face carvings with scratches. There you go. You guys want to create that effect? Well, she, let's, let's pan in on her and let's see how she looks like with it. I mean, very pretty, cute. Can't say nothing wrong with that. Now, this is nice, very interesting. Okay, good job. Good job. You guys are into that style. What else they got here? Then we got here an exclusive for Wicca Originals. I like Wicca Originals. They do make some amazing outfits. And I've bought a couple items from there, there too. So, there's nothing wrong with that. Very steampunk meets goth darkness. I like Bur Tim Burton's hands. Remember Tim Burton with the uh, Edward Scissor hands? There you go. If you guys can see it better like that. Okay. And oh, there they are right there. Okay, Burton's hands. There's you got the couple poles over here as well. And you got the Valia necklace. So if you guys are into that style, go for it. Now, this looks like it appears to be a mass murder. All right, I don't know what to say of this, but it is a mass murder. Hmm, I wonder who. But it's very interesting, and mm, I know what this is. This is from DRD. I love DRD. You guys can use this as displays if you guys are opening up a store or display your shit. You know, there you go. I do like this. Now this is cool. It's got this really amazing effect. Okay, and this. What's up with this over here? Now, this is kind of twisted. Her head and her stuff has been splattered out. This looks like it is... Oh, evidence. Oh, the little feather duster. Okay, I can see where that's coming from. Ah, all right. Well, there you go. It's a mass murder committed there. Interesting. Alright, oh, this is the office right there, okay. Well, this is a short little display of it though, but you get, you'll get you get the drift. Now, what's going on over here, guys? Le fil casse, as always, some gorgeous negligee for the girls. Mm -hmm. Can be used as everyday wear with a pair of high heels or, hey, fantasy role play, whatever works for you girls. Now, Insomnia Angels, you got this cute little eye patch, another accessory to use if you guys are into accessorizing. There you go. It looks like there's some ghost dancing in the background there. And we got here from Static. We got some, oh, this is interesting. Create that effect. Oh, there she goes right there. We got some pasties. All right, from Ursh, Ursh Designs, we got this, oh, okay, we got some outfits over here, we got this little Odette style outfit, if you guys are into it, there you go, go for it, great for picture taking too, so let the imagination flow on that, accessorize, you know, you take pictures, always accessorize your pictures, now this is dope, I do like this, Badass wings. Hey, I never say no to wings. They call the Hemithian wings. There you go. It does come with a color HUD, animesh vampire wings accessories, five floating animations, and four stationary poses. Oh, so that's pretty cool. Hmm, I do like this. The wings are nice, though. Hmm. Hmm. Let me not do like the last time when I did one event that I bought me a pair of wings that came out to about 1,200, 1200 lindens. Yeah, that was not cute, but hey, I love them. They're the best wings I've ever seen in the SL. Dark Valentine Carp Nectum. Nectum. Carp Nectum. Dark Valentine's Legacy Perk Exclusive Dress. So, hey, very cute, very Chanel looking. 
like here what do we got poses let me see that's a dome obviously that's a background there but the poses it's a little vampiric effect and she's holding a knife to his face now girls you know what I'm gonna get with this right when you see your man and you tell him listen if I ever catch you fucking with some other bitch I swear that I will cut you up in pieces don't you ever mess with any other bitch otherwise than me that's my bloody valentine <laughs> sorry guys <laughs> I was just having a relapse but now this is awesome though this little backdrop over here now this is cute though I am digging this I like this great 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 for picture taking whoo I'm just channeling mommy dearest for a second now I do like this the altar of love there you go that says a statement all to itself it's three land impact let's take a quick look at that hey want to do some voodoo there we go this is perfect I like this this I can relate to this I right. Hey, I've been to New Orleans. I've seen stuff like this. So, yes, that's cool. And if you want to run around the grid with a hatchet in your head, hey, it's, that's another look. But, hey, it is cute. It is from Rainbow Sunday. So, yeah, that's just a statement all to itself right there. And you got your little Dixie cup. No, wait, not your little Dixie cup. That's where you buy it from. Sorry. Wow. It's Jack and Marcy. He threw her the hatchet. She, she she slugged him in his chest. There you go. She's that's a statement all to itself. Now, guys, what do we got here? Now, this has to be from Contraption. I know that, right? It got to be because I know Contraption. Oh no, Lux Eterna. Now, Lux Eterna. I love you guys. Lux, very nice, very nice. I've met them before. They were really amazing. Now this is a gorgeous dress, a very 1930s Jean Harlow look. Love it, love it, love it. If you could hook it up, it is called a Darlene. There it is, let the imagination roll. Now it does come in an array of colors. She's sitting there debating whether she should get it. I would, if I was on my female avatar, definitely I would. Now for the guys also, you got this little look for the guys. Now this is all right. Now, you, the girls will wear the girls' outfit, the boys, the Klaus, because this is called the Klaus, if you guys can see. It could create that little Bonnie and Clyde effect. Now, this is good. I kind of like this, now. There's nothing wrong with this style. Really nice for the guys. Good job, Lukes. As always, you make some really nice, nice items. Then we got Crook Couture. Crook Couture. Now, look at this little gorgeous number over here. Now, this is cute. Um, very nice. The Morticia. Ooh, Morticia Adams. Yes, girl. Mm-hmm. Now, Morticia does come in an array of colors, if you guys can tell. And for the guys also as well, the Gomez. Morticia and Gomez, guys. Gomez. Gomez, really? Gomez. <laughs> All right, let's go around this corner over here. What do we got over here, guys? Ah, after party. Okay, I think I completed my mission, and there I am. All right. Uh-huh. There you go, boys and girls. All right, let me couple squat over here. And just. All right, I'm going to stand right here. Like I said... This event started today. It's called My Bloody Valentine, boys and girls. So, if you guys are interested in any of the items below, I will be leaving a landmark in the video description. Guys, take a quick browse over here. Just buy your stuff, enjoy it, and have fun with it. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. It's all about fantasy, roleplay, and having fun in your second life. Now... Like I said, it started today, and I'm not quite sure when it's going to be making its course up to. I would assume until February 14th, but I can be wrong, boys and girls. I'm not quite sure, but come over, check it out, have fun. All right, guys, well, this has been another edition of What's Going On Around the Grid with...
with moi as always big hugs and kisses to all of you so you guys enjoy your valentine i sure will and uh hey stay real stay true to yourself much love boys and girls and see you in the next round in what's going on around the grid all right guys take care and much love bye now <laughs>